This is a 2009 Ford Escape. We'll be replacing the ABS module here. You're gonna need a number 13 or 14 wrench, 13 socket. ABS module is located right here in front of the passenger vehicle under the master cylinder. Um, so first off we're gonna do is using a number 14. We're gonna remove the lines here to pl and plug them up because it's going to master cylinder. Some brake fluid may come out. So I'm gonna go ahead and get th these two out here and plug them. Once I do that, using a number 13, I'm gonna remove these other four uh, lines here. Uh, I went ahead and marked them just to help me out. These are in the front, these are in the back. It's not really that hard to find out. Once you remove those, there'll be three 13 millimeter bolts holding this in place on the bracket. Uh, here's our new one here. So you can see there's two on the side directly in the front right there, as well as one in the bottom. So let's get these lines out and then we get the ABS module out. So I've removed all the lines to the ABS module here, as well as the three bolts holding it to the frame. Uh, I did, for however, forget to mention that before you actually remove it and unplug it, everything, you will need a scanner in order to capture the module information to transfer to the new module. So I'll just give you an FYI. Um, I'll pretty much show at the end of the video how I did it. Uh, just hook up the scanner and capture the information. So once I put the new one in and load that information to the new module, um, I'm gonna show you how it's done. Uh, so now I'm gonna go ahead and start trying to get this out. It's pretty much, it's obstructed on something right now. I believe it's because it's plugged in right here. Um, it's, it's one of those that have like a latch on top, I believe, or on the side. Let's get it out. So I'm gonna go ahead and remove this and try to get this module out. So I got the old ABS module slash ABS pump. Uh, out of the vehicle my new one here uh just a couple fyis to removing it i failed to mention because i didn't realize it that there is this part right here uh so this little block right here uh, it's gonna hold on to a bottom bracket with a 10 millimeter nut here it's directly below the <sighs> plug right here so with this plug you actually before you can pull this lever up you're gonna have to squeeze the sides here to pull it up uh it wasn't too bad actually doing so. Uh, so now I'm gonna go ahead and get the new one installed. So that bracket will actually, or that little block I told you of with a 10 millimeter nut is actually attaches to the bottom here. Um, so in the vehicle it would be, let's see, this would be the bottom port right here. So it's gonna attach to the bottom here. So I'm gonna go ahead and slide this in, get it placed in there and get everything back in order. And then uh, once I get everything mounted back, I'll show you the, how to program it. So now that I have the new ABS module, ABS pump installed here, uh, everything's tightened down. The three bolts to the frame are in, as well as that 10 millimeter at the bottom holding the, uh, the block for the lines in place and all the lines. I believe there's a total of four to six lines. Um, I went ahead and also topped off the dot three brake fluid to the max line here. So now we're gonna go ahead and program this new ABS module in the vehicle. So in the vehicle, prior to this uh, right here, pretty much it said, turn on the vehicle and it captures the information of the previous module, turn off the vehicle. So now we're gonna install the new module that I told us to do. I'm gonna hit okay, set the ignition switch to on. All right. I wonder how long this takes. Oh, well, I'm gonna let it do this and I'll restart the video once it completes this configuring. So literally right after I turned it off, or I turned the video off, it changed the set ignition switch to position off. So I'm gonna turn it off. Okay, turn the ignition on. All right, and now that we've done so, Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and, before I do that, I'm gonna go ahead and bleed the brakes here. So ABS service bleed. All right. So depress the brake and hold it. So I'm gonna let that bleed out. So right now, ABS pump is pretty much bleeding everything out. 
So I'm gonna restart the video once it's done. Um, actually, no, after this is done, everything will be done. Just need to clear any codes that pop up. So I'm gonna let this go and then clear any codes involved in the ABS module and I'll be done. So thanks for watching guys. Please like and subscribe, more videos to come. Oh, all the next time as well. Thanks for watching guys.